When Mohamed Salah was replaced in the second half of Liverpool's tie against Chelsea on Sunday, the Egyptian forward threw a fit and Roy Keane instructed him to sit down and shut up. After new Chelsea defender Axel de Saussure raised Luis Dias's early goal, the two teams battled out an exciting draw. Nonetheless, Salah cut an unhappy figure when he was substituted for Bendoke's fresh legs in the second half. Salah flung his wristband on the ground out of fury, and Sky Sports analyst Keane told him, It's okay to be upset, but don't keep it up for too long. He shook his head before sitting down on the bench and raising his arms. Shut up and sit down. You must accept it. Be upset, but try not to dwell on it. We've seen a lot better players removed from the game than Salah. It happens. Klopp continued, We are here to win a game, as Salah sought to break the record for the most goals scored in a Premier League opening weekend. Mo is really essential, yet we must still make choices. We required new legs. He owns 500 unique recordings. I am at a loss for words. The 31-year-old failed to score on the first day of the Premier League season for the first time while playing for Liverpool. After 77 minutes, the Egyptian striker was replaced by Ben Doak. He was furious over the decision to remove him and waved his fist in the air in the direction of the bench before stumbling over to the touchline. Salah, who had posed a threat the whole first half, was agitated as he left the field, ripping the tape off of his hand and tossing it on the ground. He didn't shake hands with his manager, Jurgen Klopp, who stayed in the technical area and didn't approach the attacker, instead walking directly to the Liverpool bench and high-fiving his successor. On commentary at the time, Gary Neville exclaimed, Oh, he's snapped. And Jamie Carragher concurred, saying, In some ways, I can understand the frustration. He was outstanding in the opening period. In terms of attacking involvement in the game, Liverpool has been absent in the second half. What is he to do as a result? An exquisite left-footed pass from Salah, who joined Liverpool in 2017, found Luis Diaz, who stretched to lob the ball past custodian Robert Sanchez after 18 minutes. This was Liverpool's first goal of the game. Shortly after the Egyptian looked to have increased their advantage, he scored his first goal of the 2023-24 season by eluding Chelsea's defence and beating the goalie of the Blues in one a non-combat. Salah was barely ahead of the last defender when the goal was ruled for offside following a VAR review. After 37 minutes, De Sassi equalised the score by coming into the area in the middle and shooting the ball past Alisson to score in his Premier League debut in front of the shed end. Ben Chilwell's goal for Chelsea would also be disallowed due to an offside ruling. Salah, meantime, has scored in each of Liverpool's first six Premier League games this season, giving him eight goals overall. He now shares that record with both Wayne Rooney and Alan Shearer. However, he disclosed the tactical justifications for the replacement, saying, I can understand because if Mo scored it would have been a new record for goals scored in the opening game, but I didn't think about that. After the game, 
Klopp acknowledged he understood the forward's anger. We required both stability and new legs. Everyone experienced extreme intensity. That's all I have to say about it. His response was perfectly acceptable. I would be really surprised when I sub a player and he is jumping into my arms at 1-2-1 and he is a striker who thinks he will score, so that's absolutely fine, I said.